Hi, it's Lee. Welcome to another 10 minute collage challenge. So I'm using only images from this Daphne's diary that I'm working my way through nearly nearly to the end. Got a few bits that I've already cut out here. Um, that's off one of the covers. I think I'm going to use that. I think I had taken this image out, but I think I might use that as my focal point in today's collage. She would fit nicely on there. I just need to cut that bottom off. Okay, so let me have a look. Timer. Ten minutes. Let's get going. <coughs> so I hope everybody's well and happy, been doing lots of crafting and collaging and generally enjoying life, I hope. Been busy making journals. One in particular. So it's uh, been taking a long time to get it done. It's quite a big book. It's um, 10 by 7, I think the cover is. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to when it's finished. And it'll be going up in my Etsy store. Oh, big blob. Get rid of that. Yes, um, it's a botanical themed journal. So um, I've been doing lots of like little watercolour what do you call it? abstract images like doing a watercolour background and then doodling plants and things onto it to uh, go in the, the journal trying to make as much of it um, you know like handcrafted as I can stuff that I've created myself rather than um, you know, to use pre-made ephemera and things like that. So that all takes time, and I don't want it to look like everybody else's journals as well. So doing my own stuff and adding it into the journal is individualising it for me, and um, hopefully somebody will get to enjoy it. Sooner rather than later, I guess. <coughs> Oops, there's my glue. Let's pick that up. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we just need to fill in that little patch in the middle with something. With some text or something. This will do. No, maybe not that because it's got those words on it that I really like. Uh, what have we got here? This will do. Sound like I'm repeating myself. <laughs> Chop this off. Yeah, that's nice. I like that nice irregular shape. required there. Okay, so I just need to chop the bottom of this off because it won't go in so nicely if I don't. I like that. And I think something else just needs to come off the side of it. So I'll look in here. Not sure about that bird. Let's see what else is in here. If I can't find anything, I might have to go into the actual book. Oh, that's cute. Hedgehog. Pity you can't see a bit more of it. Maybe a flower. I've got a flower. Maybe she needs something bright and colourful next to her. So I've got that one that's huge. Oh, that's nice. No, it's not right. That looks quite good. Okay. I should keep this. I need to make a wire. Something. This is a little wire tree. 
I wanted a little wire flower to go on the cover of my journal. I was just going to make it out of, um, you know, jewellery wire. That's not square. I cannot cut a straight line. I always go out one way. Okay, so let's work out which is the best way to do that. Not that way. Not that way. Maybe that way. Yeah, I think that'll do. So I'll stick down this bit first. Probably. Oh. Oh, I like that better. Yes, I like that much better. It's funny sometimes when you turn over the your piece of paper to glue and then you see something that you like better on the other side. Maybe it should go this way. I'll be here for half an hour deciding <laughs> which way I want to put it. I want to get that in. It doesn't look right. I think it looks better when it's just this here. I'm just going to narrow it down a little bit. Hopefully it's straight. Yeah, I think that's better. Okay, going to go with this. There, and this is a bit thicker than the other papers so I'm going to use a bit of art glitter glue on it and make sure it doesn't come off. edge with a bit of stabilo. It'll just go around the girl. And I'm just going to activate that with some water. brush is a little bit um, funny. Let's just say funny. It's had a hard life. Do I need to go around that other bit? I've got time to do it. I might as well. minute and 15 left. Do I want to do some splatters? I've got time. Let me see. Okay, I've got my gouache here. Let's see if I can get some without making too much mess. And what colour? I might go for purple. A 
I don't want to hit my finger because of this one because it's got arthritis and it really hurts. Twenty four seconds to go. Maybe a little bit of black. And I've got four, three, two, one, time's up. Okay. There we go. Another little ten minute collage done. I like this one. I really like it. Let me know in the comments what you think. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you don't like it. Let me know what you think you could do better. Uh, and... Um, if uh, you think you can, you could to improve on it, let me know what you would have done because I'm always interested in hearing about that. And uh, we'll see you in another video. So the hashtag for this is 10, so the numeral 10 minute collage. And there's a link in my video description box. So take care, happy crafting, hope you have a wonderful um, rest of the week. And... Uh, I'll see you in the next video. So cheers from Australia. Hooroo!